Papers and Leap both allow you to apply a 5-star rating to PDFs. You can use the ratings to signify anything you want. We recommend consistently using the ratings for caliber, potency, or appeal. We prefer using it for caliber because caliber ratings are less likely to change. Now, you can show or hide the caliber ratings by selecting the Columns menu and going down to My Rating. Once you've done that, you can directly apply a rating in the uh, My Rating column. So you can change the rating like this, for instance, to make it a 5-star or a 2-star. You can also use the Inspector to apply rating. You can reveal the Inspector here, or in the View menu, and then notice that there's a rating field down here, and then you can change the rating. When you're working on a project that calls for uh, several different PDF files, then you can put all the PDF files that are pertinent to the project in a folder, such as this example here. And once you've done that, you can um, sort the uh, PDFs according to uh, any column that you want, including your rating. So in this case, um, I can see in descending order the um, highest caliber papers that are pertinent to this hypothetical project. You can easily move the columns around to make them more easily accessible. Once you've rated papers using uh, the papers rating system, you can, in principle, um, search for papers that have a certain rating. So here I created a smart collection, which I'll show you the uh, definition of. So this is to match every paper whose rating is five star. Okay, and then if I look at the ratings column here, this now matches several five star rated papers, but it's actually included files that have no rating. So there's a problem there.